Sorry for my cough. So, if you're going to die, just do it quietly. Now that was me. Sorry for being a Scottish bastard. You're I'll forgiven. Food in the masters. Okay, deck B. I can have a flight of stairs. Sorry, I just cleared my throat there. So, we're looking for the Vesuvius Bar. Bruno the Barman. Well, there's a couple of pool tables here, so I'm assuming it's going to be around here somewhere. There's one of the security guards. Cheerful looking fellas. Is this a bar? Oh, was I me? Don't worry. Hi. Here he is. Sorry, let's have a seat. This is the bit I'm on my game at the moment, actually. Okay, I've taken a seat and nothing's happening. Um, so, oh wait, I've got to talk to the barman first. You've got to first. take a seat opposite the bar. Yeah, I, 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 re I realise I have to actually talk to the barman first. He's singing, but his mouth isn't even moving. But he is singing. I'm not sure what. Bonjour, oh, mon ami. Oh, he's calling me a slut. You sneaky little devil, do you? Bish. Bish. I ask no questions. You steal their wallet. Half it is for you. Half it is for Bruno. But don't think you will be tricking Bruno. Oh no! I'll have you thrown into the brig. Now. Take a seat at the end of the bar and wait for my signal. Uh oh, wait. Um, yeah, I better get a weapon before I do this, otherwise it, I look a little bit daft. Yeah, use one of these cheeky pull cue. That would do me. Have a seat over it. Wait for him to give me the wink. I just think he's flying with me. Always oh, stop giving me that cheeky wink, you fucker. You sexy French bastard. Oh, yeah. Bar steward, as you as would be appropriate. Okay, <laughs> All right, here we go. Giving me the cheeky little wink there. Gave him a little, blew him a little kiss back and, uh, oh, he's going in the toilet. Perfect. No cameras in the toilet. <laughs> that shut oh. the door behind me. Oh, lovely. So he's left the door open so I can see him. I'm in a little way. I'm gonna hear you back in the mouse. Oh. Yeah, I kind of, uh. Well. Oh, his arm looks a bit crooked. Yeah, so I finished him off with Paul Q in a bog. Shut the door there. Nice surprise. And so, yeah, picked up his wallet and now we go back and share the monies with uh, Bruno the bar steward. Hello, pretty ladies. Oh. No joke. <laughs> Not you. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Maybe later. Okay. Oh, okay. Pay the barman. <laughs> Pay. Give money. Medium amount. Um. Hmm. How much money did I pick up? I can't remember. Must have picked up it. What is this little guy? Oops. Are you trying to give Bruno the change that is short? Um. Formidable! I knew you were the one for the job! I'm not giving him so much money that Take I've got less than I had before. <coughs> <up another> <coughs> Too sweet. Too sweet. Okay, this time I'll give him a bit more to begin with, so I don't end up giving him loads. Oh, that pretty lady's coming over. There he goes, giving me the wink again. Make sure I don't pull out a weapon in front of the grumpy looking security guard. Okay, I've got the green light at the moment. Another one 
find out. That's given me a thousand. I remember how much money it's been giving me. <laughs> Shalmon. Oh, I need to sleep soon. No wonder you can't see what it was, you got your hat over your eyes. What was that? <laughs> That's the kitchen. Need to find a bedroom and go to sleep, as you can see, top left. Uh, basically you have needs, kind of like the Sims, and if you don't, there are severe consequences. Such as, when you don't drink, and become too dehydrated, you actually turn to dust. Which is visually quite hilarious. But yes, fulfilling the needs of your uh, character means that you are left vulnerable to attacks. Because uh, there will not be cameras in places where you need to drink or eat or sleep or wash, or go to the toilet. Aha, I found a bed. Brilliant. Quick. Oh, a shovel, that'll be a good weapon. And a katana. That'll do me. <laughs> right. So, sleepy time. Alright, so it. I need to drink soonish. Back up to deck B. Hmm, deja vu. take the cat out soon because she keeps doing it. It's really annoying. Slow. Just casually walk past that dead body. It's me. Um so I can't actually buy a drink from a guy who's a bomb. Brilliant. Pay the barman, of course. Pay. Call me Dad. I knew you were the one for the job. Take a chair. I'll serve you up another victim. Too sweet. I think the multiplayer. Uh, sort of side of this game is a lot better because you're in a server where you are hunting from the beginning just like this game but you've got someone another human player hunting you which means you're always looking over your shoulder at people who are looking at you or maybe trying to make it look like they're not following you or are following you you just don't know you end up getting paranoid and I think not many games make you feel like that and at the same time it's funny it's not taken too seriously Rihanna's come over. There we go, got the wink. What we get? Oh, shut up. Oh, there's a camera there, better not take out a weapon here. Let's go this way. Oh, there's a witness in here, gotta be careful. Totally done. Bit of a dramatic pose to die with.
formidable. I knew you were the one for the job. Take a chair. I serve you up another victim. Too sweet. I don't think the single player version of the game does do justice to this game as a whole because the, sort of the main feature of the game is a multiplayer in my opinion but since it is dead at the moment so much point me showing that part of the game unfortunately yoink However, over Christmas, hopefully there will be a deal where it's very cheap and loads of people will try it at least and see how fun it is. Formidable! I knew you were the one for the job. Take a chair. Oh, another I'll one. Serve you up another victim. Too sweet. This must be the last one. I don't really understand what they're coming over to actually talk about. I just come over for a chat and walk away, sort of mid sentence. Let me guess, this one's going into the toilet. No, I guess wrong. How are you doing? I do need to drink quite badly now, but it's tempting just to uh, show you all what happens when you do get too dehydrated. Formidable! I knew you were the one for the job. Enough, my greedy little friend. They flick. The guards are getting suspicious. Well, they're great at their job, aren't they? Oh, okay, so I've got a new uh, quarry bottom right there. Uh, Santorini Restaurant Deck B. Could this be in here? Yeah, here it is. Ah. Cool, oh, he looks rough. Hello. I hear you're looking to make some money. I'd like you to get your hands on King Mescalam Doug's helmet. Oh, I bet no you do. scholar of Sumerian antiquities, you, I see. It's wrought in the finest gold. The most magnificent helmet you could ever feast your eyes on. It's being transported in the cargo hold. There's a guard, but it should be short work for a ruffian such as yourself. Yes, absolutely. So, deck deity. Dust, I fear. Oh, Needs to be fine. Wait, found a flare gun, and a revolver, and a Winchester, and a blunderbuss. Now I'm gonna have some real fun. Oh Did you wait, get arrested? hang on. Oh, if I turn to dust, I think I lose. Yeah, I think I lose everything if I actually turn to dust. Turns of dust. I wouldn't have cared before, but now I've got something decent. I'm 
about to die, I feel. Yeah, I just turned to dust. <laughs> <laughs> Did it look cool? Oh, it wasn't really worth me losing those guns. Because, I mean, those guns are calling themselves the flare gun sets people and everything around it, them on fire. <laughs> oh, I've got to go back to the fence. Well, I think I'm going to wrap up the episode here. As you've seen, sort of what the game's about, and hopefully I'll carry on and continue the story. Uh, hopefully over Christmas, though, uh, the multiplayer side will pick up. And uh, I've heard that the people who have now bought the uh, rights to the game from Outer Light um, are looking to do it up, give it a bit of polish, and release sort of a new version, maybe. Uh, which I really look forward to because it was such a great game when it was popular online. One of the most fun games I had multiplayer wise. So, uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, well, my failure at most point. Well, I, well, let's just say half decent attempt at playing the single player side Ooh. of the ship. But uh, hopefully, I will look to continue the story and maybe actually finish it because I never got around to it but yeah thank you very much for watching um, don't forget to like or dislike the video whichever you choose um, subscribe to us and you can always comment with criticism um, or maybe even positive reactions they're always welcome so thank you very much for watching see you later